to clean and uh, maintain your waffle maker so you're going to take or you're going to be needing a cutting a hundred percent cutting hand towel or you can use a handkerchief make sure it is not plug i'm using god to beg you people make sure when before you do this it is not plugged because of the granite pan can be very hot to avoid stories that touches the heart now you want to take the um, rag uh, damp put it in water make sure that it is not dripping water so after you put it in soapy water squeeze it like squeeze it dry then you can proceed to taking the damp rag and and start cleaning it make sure to get in there and scrub 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 body and um, crust away um, this is going to ensure that you are healthy it's actually very easy to clean because it doesn't nothing inside stick so all you might just have is a little flour that is stuck here and there um, this process generally just takes me two minutes I make sure that after I finish making my waffles I clean it so now you're going to rinse that same towel and come back and just you know get in there and clean everywhere you have used the soapy damp towel to clean um before um that's just it it doesn't it doesn't this is i know why i'm doing this video guys before somebody who dipped everything into running water in their sink and come to tell me that's for it please do not um dip your waffle maker into water now if you see the way i put my hand into it there's another way you can do to get into all those little little um i don't know what those holes are called called maybe jiri jiri uh, all those jiri jiri to really clean it out um this is how you can do that put your hand inside it just makes the grip easier so please do not put your waffle maker inside um running water okay just use a damp towel and clean it and that's all it it's easier to clean this than to clean um a a toaster i know when i want to clean my toaster because of i had this toaster growing up um that was still that's one that's why i hate things that are half still inside the bread crust will stick so bad that cleaning it will be so hectic but i usually just enjoy cleaning this because it's a granite pan everything the moment you're just cleaning everything just goes out immediately it does not waste time at all so you can use after you have cleaned it with a damp rag you can go with a dry rag and just make sure no water is left inside or you can use um a tissue paper or a servet after you have cleaned with a damp rag and just make sure that there's no um water inside so this is just me showing you the different techniques you can clean you can put your hand inside the rag you can use the rag like that and you can fold the rag like a fish roll and use it to scrub it out do not use a sponge or an iron sponge do not scratch um your granite it's going to make your um waffles burn the inner granite coating should be maintained with a lot of love with a whole lot of love to make sure that you get the best quality every time so um i'm going to be dropping a lot of waffle um recipes so make sure you can enjoy these recipes